All right, Tom, thank you so much. Miss Angie Severson is here today with Lainey Florin, Violet Beers, and Jess Sinclair. And school's back in session. School is back in session. That means Miss Angie's place is a little busier because we have kids stopping by after class. And Miss Angie's place is in Pine Island, and you have some events coming up that you wanted to share with us. How are you, by the way? I am exhausted. How yes. are you? I'm, I'm great. Yeah. <laughs> Why are you so exhausted? Well, because, yeah, school is busy, but <laughs> summer camps were crazy town this summer. So It went yeah, well? It was just like, yep. yeah. Yeah. Okay. So what do you have coming up that you want to share with us today? So our Naturescapes program is back in session, and that's Tuesdays from 9 a.m. to 12 p.m., and that's in Pine Island. Mm -hmm. And tomorrow we have Megan Long coming over, and she is a naturalist at Oxbow and Zolman Zoo. Okay, so. so we're looking for kids. What ages can come and check this out? So the ages for this is ages 4 through 12. Okay. And it's a little bit harder in the school year, um, but a lot of our kids are homeschool kids or um, sure. preschool. Yeah. So Miss Angie's place, you moved to a new location here recently. Mm -hmm. How was that? Amazing. Yes. Do you still have the other spot or does someone else have that now? We mm -hmm. don't have that spot anymore. So actually it's pretty cool. Um, a uh, mom in Pine Island now uses it for a homeschool co-op. Okay. So it's super cool that it's still educational. Sure. Focused. I drove by and I saw some people in there and I was yeah. just curious as to what, what it is. Um, so we have this event coming up. What time is it and how do the people have to register? Yeah, you have to register online. So it's at our, on our website, missangiesplace.org. And then the program itself, Megan will be there at 10 a.m. tomorrow. Okay. All right. Looking forward to that. So we have some students here. Violet, what grade are you in? Fifth grade, do you go to Miss Angie's place? Yes. Yeah. How often do you go? Um, every Monday. Every Monday. Okay, what are some of your favorite things to do at Miss Angie's place? Um, I really like geocaching. Oh, how do you do that? For those at home that don't know what geocaching is. Um, so you, like on a GPS, you, um, uh, you find find the spot where it is, but then you have to search around that area to find where the treasure is. Yeah, it's almost like searching for treasure yes. in an advanced way now with GPS. Yes. That's so cool. And Lainey, how are you? I'm good. Good. And what grade are you in this year? I'm in seventh grade. Seventh grade. What's your favorite part about Miss Angie's Place? When we go to either the Pine Island City Park or we go to Collins Park and we catch crayfish. Oh, crayfish. What do you do with the crayfish? Do you let them back? You let them go again? Mm -hmm. You yeah. do? How many, do you usually catch a lot of crayfish? Last time we went, we caught 32, I think. Oh. <laughs> okay, so you catch a lot of crayfish. That's pretty cool. How do you catch them? With a net? Yeah, we take a bunch of nets and we'll find them in groups. Put the net behind them and take your fingers and run in front of them. Okay. Because they go backwards. That's exciting. How many kids are usually with you, with you when you're out there doing that? Four or five. Okay, very nice. And Jess, you're newer here. Yeah. Are you helping out this year? How's it going? Um, so I'm just here for the first semester helping out with okay. Miss Angie's. Okay, fantastic. All right, Miss Angie's place. For those at home that maybe are looking for a, a place for kids to hang out, enjoy the outdoors, um, can they utilize your services? Yes, and actually now we, um, so what we say it's ages 0 to 115. Okay. Because I haven't met a 116 year old yet, but <laughs> okay. when I do, then we have to change it. Um, but we have stuff for people of all ages. So tonight we have yoga. There's two sessions. Oh. And that's for adults. So 615 to 7. So is more the adults. Yeah. Okay. And then 715 to 8. Are you leading the yoga? Like, oh, you're not a yogi? I. No, I love yoga, but I do art and nature. Okay. And then I have other people do like the spirituality and the movement stuff. So I just get to go and enjoy it. Okay, that's great. So one more time here, let's talk about Naturescapes. What do people need to know if they would like to check it out? Oh, sorry. No, you're fine. It's just rubbing <laughs> against your shirt. Um, what do people need to know? What do they need to know for Naturescapes? Yep. One more time here. So for Naturescapes tomorrow, we have our Oxbo Naturalist coming, and that uh, Naturescapes is from 9 a.m. to 12 p.m., and you can register online at missangiesplace.org. Okay. It's for ages 4 to 12, and it's a, it's a guided nature place. So it's really based, um, it's the kids' focus, so they just end up finding things. Critters is one of our favorite things to find. Yeah. Um, we also go to the garden. We put in aspects of art in there. Um, I'm an art teacher, so we also do that. Um, and then I'm looking at the photos on there, too. We just got yeah. our new sign up on our building. Ooh, okay. Thanks to David Hewitt at Narrative Perfect. Graphics. Yep. 
Fantastic. Yeah, so just figuring out all the cool stuff that we have in Pine Island. Yeah, there's a lot to do and some new friendships and people that yep. you can meet. Um, Violet, what do we have here? What are some of these items that we brought today? Um, a net, birdhouse, and then... Oh, there's a turtle over there. Yeah, there's a turtle, and then... Um, He's stretchy. Oh, he, funky. <laughs> he feels funky. <laughs> and then um, a net to... For the bugs. For the bugs, yeah. All right. Thank you guys for being here. Anything more that we'd like the viewers at home to know? It is Pine Island's homecoming, so go Panthers. Oh, yes. Oh. And we have Adam Sandler here. Adam Sandler, Adam Sandler come here. here. Come here. <laughs> it's Adam Sandler Day today. What, at Pine Island Elementary? Pine Island Elementary. Okay, so we have one version of Adam Sandler here. She said, uh, Mom, I, <laughs> I don't want to be on TV today because I'm dressed like Adam Sandler. But you, you make a good Adam Sandler. Look good at work. The good work. So can see <laughs> That's Ivory, by the way. Oh, man. Thank you guys so much for being here. We appreciate it. Miss Angie's Place, you can learn more about it on our website. That's KTTC.com. Miss Angie's Place from Pine Island. All right, we have to take a quick break. Trending stories are coming up when we return, including just how big.